What's up everybody, it's Flux with FluxWithIt.com and today I'm going to show you the Chaos Pad 2 uh, modification that I just came up with. Uh, I've been, I, I've had this thing for a really long time and the main gripe that I've always had about this thing is that when you manipulate the XY pad, you can record that information, but the only way to play it back is to hold down this spring-loaded lever here. Uh, so you can't have it you know, making circles on the pad when your hand is off of the controller completely because it's spring loaded and, you know, it just, it works like that. So what I always wanted was for a way to just to toggle it on and off. So I got bored today and I decided, you know what, I'm going to add a toggle switch to this so that when I turn it on, uh, it, it'll continually modulate. So let's check out what we've done here. And I have pictures of how to do it and an article along with this over at fluxwithit.com. So here is a pattern coming from the MS-20 Mini. And what I'm going to do is... This is how it normally works. You have to hold that down. Now, I can just switch this toggle switch on. And if you want to record different patterns, you can do that. So just very easy, it's a simple modification, just two wires uh, inside of the chaos pad. It took me about maybe 20 minutes tops to get this done, and now I have a chaos pad that uh, I don't have to hold down the pad motion to keep a cool modification uh, modulation going. Again, the way that it originally would work is you would have to hold this down. And mute still works. So, a very simple modification, very easy to do. And check out fluxwithit.com for details on how to build this modification your own uh, so that you can increase the usability of this uh, great effects product. Peace.